Hi guys, this is Anash Sharma and in this session we will discuss the date diff means date difference dex function in power bi date diff function it returns the number of units unit is specified in interval between the input two dates what it mean as you can see in the syntax in the syntax we have three parameters date one date two and interval it means we have to supply the two dates and it will calculate the difference between these two dates then interval means in which format you want to you want the result say in second minute hours day week month quarter or year here important thing is if date 2 is greater than date 1 then the result is the positive if date 1 is greater than the date 2 then result is the negative before we start the practical of the date day function we have some data so we check this data we have the employee name in Excel sheet, then birth date and joining date. So birth date, we can calculate the age of the employee. Means we can calculate the difference between the birth date and the two date. Then joining date, we can calculate the service period of the employee. It means the difference between the joining date and the two date. Now we check how to use the date diff function practically in Power BI. So we have the data, data already uploaded employee name, birth date and journey date. First of all, we have to calculate the age of the employee. It means the difference between the birth date and the today. So, new column, employee age, then date diff. First parameter, employees birth date second parameter comma today current date time today then so we want to display the interval means in year then year enter so you can see the employees according to the birth date so it is a difference between the birth date and the today. So this is the age of the all the employees. Now second is the joining date. Now suppose we want to calculate the service period of the each and every employee. New column. Service period. Then date diff first parameter joining date second today then again year now enter so you can see we have the list of this service period for how long the employee has been working in the company. Now, suppose we want to calculate the bonus. If the service period is greater than two years, then the employee is eligible for the bonus, otherwise not. Now, new column, bonus. date diff then employee joining date second today then again year here we can apply the condition with the if statement so if then say greater than 2 if the service period is greater than 2 then eligible and if not then not eligible
enter so you can see if the service period is greater than 2 then it's eligible otherwise not eligible so this is how you can use the date diff function in power bi dex so guys this was all about the dex function date diff in power bi thanks for watching the video